Mr Speaker, extremely closely. Question number 10, Derek Ball. Thank you, Mr Speaker. My question is to the Minister of Defence. What recent reports has he seen regarding Navy patrol vessel activity? The Honourable Ron Mark. Mr Speaker. Mr Speaker, yesterday I saw a report about the successful ongoing deployment of the inshore patrol vessel HMNZS Topol to Fiji. I was particularly pleased to hear that the combined operation on its first patrol confiscated the entire catch of six commercial fishing vessels who were alleged to have been fishing illegally inside the Kualalevu Lagoon, which is traditional fishing, fishing ground. This is part of Operation Wasawasa 2 where New Zealand and Fiji are working together to help patrol Fiji's exclusive economic zone and enforce regulations for inshore fishing. Working with HMNZS Topo are sailors from both the New Zealand and Fijian navies and fisheries officers from uh, both New Zealand and Fiji as well. I'd like to congratulate the commanding officer of Topo, Topo Lieutenant Ben Flight, and his crew for their outstanding work. Supplementary. Uh, how does Operation Waswasa 2 support the government's Pacific reset? Mr Speaker, Navy patrols into the Pacific help aid regional prosperity and security, which is of fundamental importance to New Zealand. The Pacific faces a growing array of challenges. The strategic environment is also changing and becoming more contested. Recognising this, New Zealand has announced a reset of our approach to the region. Joint operations such as Wasawasa 2 are an important aspect of the government's focus on building deeper partnerships and cooperation with Pacific Island nations and assisting them in building their capability and capacity to effectively monitor and patrol and police their own territorial waters. This deeper and more mature partnership reinforces the significant increase to New Zealand's ODA in the Pacific. Can I, can I say? Both answers have been too long. To the Minister. What further deployments to Fiji of Navy patrol vessels will take place this year? Mr. Speaker, in mid August, uh, HMNZS Topol will be replaced by the offshore patrol vessel Otago. Uh, Otago, being a larger vessel, will conduct uh, patrols much further out to sea, giving Fijian authorities even greater reach. Fijian uh, fishing in Fiji is the third largest natural resource okay. sector. Thank you. Thank you. I think, I think the members have answered. There's so much good news, Mr Speaker. Supplementary. Question number 11. Supplementary. Oh, further supplementary. Derek Ball. What additional activity are Navy patrol vessels conducting within New Zealand's exclusive economic zone? Go Navy. Mr Speaker, recently the inshore patrol vessel Hawia completed three-day fisheries patrol in the, on the west coast of the South Island. Guided by information from Air Force Orion, working with officials from MPI, Hawia boarded 11 vessels over a 72-hour period, including six vessels of interest. Six vessels of interest. Six infringements were detected. And this patrol is the sixth patrol conducted so far this year by our Navy. I'd like to congratulate Lieutenant Troy Gordon and his crew, who are doing an outstanding job. Is, is that right? Quest, question number 11, Chris Bishop. <laughs> Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. Through the Minister of Police. 